Hey guys, welcome to my channel or welcome back if you have been here before. How are y'all doing? I'm so glad that you clicked on today's video. We are going to be giving my master bathroom a little makeover, <laughs> a facelift a little bit. Um, just just on one side, Brian's side had um, an issue that we needed to take care of and it just spiraled. I don't even know how it happened, but anyway, um, we decided to kind of get a new vanity and we were going back and forth on whether to just keep the what we had. I did not like the vanity tops. I wanted to definitely change those. But I wasn't sure if I wanted to keep the base and just paint it and then just get like a solid piece countertop. Um, if we did that though, we would have to get like new sinks and new faucets. And we had to have the standalone separate vanities just because that's the way that the plumbing is. But we are going to have to redo this shower because this is cracked as you can see there. So we're definitely going to have to redo the shower very soon, but we went ahead and started on this part of our master bathroom and this is what we're going to focus the video on. It's going to get a complete facelift. So I hope you stick around and enjoy the video and you guys leave me a comment and let me know how you're doing and let me know what style do you have in your home. Like, what is your decor style or overall theme in your home? Is it like farmhouse or Scandinavian or contemporary or modern? Um, there's all kinds of different styles and I definitely like a lot of, well, the modern farmhouse, but I also like all of these like rattan baskets and all of the wood tones that are kind of really popular now so I don't know I'm just kind of drawn to those things and I wouldn't necessarily say that I always have like one specific style that I stick with um, but I just kind of switch it up and go with whatever I'm drawn to so you don't know what you're doing And the walls are closing in Just remember where we're going And remember where we've been
I don't want to, but I'm gonna try When she left me, yeah, but a little bit inside You know, you know, maybe things are gonna be alright Cause I just wanna see the light Yeah, I just wanna see the light Saw the city passing by my window Was in the crowd but I felt so alone Looked at my phone like every other second My future was blurry and numb A tunnel where there's no light Oh but then you came and sat right next to me So it's been it's been a couple of days we ordered these light fixtures from Amazon they were 30 or 40 dollars I think they were I wanted I knew I wanted something that was matte black you kind of get what you pay for them I don't think they're the absolute most like sturdy but um, they'll do and they were a really great price so we got those for up here and then also I'm going to put the circular mirrors that I had in my bedroom in the old house we're gonna put them here instead of the rectangular mirrors that came with the vanity set because I thought that would just make it a little more unique or you know not as not as out of the box and then I also ordered, I thought I had enough just from like, I thought I was going to have enough from past projects and I had only four left, but I just ordered some black hardware um, from Amazon and I got six for $10. So if you need to like order hardware or anything like that, Amazon, 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 Amazon. That's where I get all of my hardware. Um, so I'm just gonna pop those on here. Ryan's gonna help. Okay, well he's gonna he's gonna put up the lights and we're gonna hang the mirrors. Do you miss me at all? Do you think about the things we used to do? So as I'm watching this footage back, I think it's just crazy how lighting 
can change the way that things like colors look. I mean, obviously my walls are not two different colors. I mean, they're not like white and gray, but this wall looks gray and it's it's literally the same color y'all watched me paint it anyway I just thought I would share um I did not go back and change the color of the walls <laughs> it's it's just the lighting Life was dull until you came I was breathless when we first met couldn't keep my hands away couple of shelves up in here and just decorate a little bit I don't have like a whole bunch of organization like I really want to have um, for like under the sink and everything just because I'm not I don't have the closet like set up yet so I thought UPS man is flying oh, so this is <laughs> this is what I have usually if we have when we have clean towels they'll go like right there but y'all i know it's well we have everything cleaned out from the other vanities and we just i just put them in here but i mean this is all of our like hair products this is like my makeup stuff and i guess because it's just like so deep in there i don't even have my makeup in there really except for like all of my lip things they're in these two things, three things. My point is I don't have a setup for good organization for that stuff yet. So I'm not going to be doing a whole bunch of stuff inside the vanities. I'm really just going to put up some cute shelves and um, just kind of finish decorating like the tops of the vanities. And that's going to be a wrap for this video. And then the next part we're going to have to finish the shower and I'll finish painting in here. We'll just do the other side of the bathroom.
decorating process but here is how everything turned out with all the kind of decor if you will in our bathroom I mean it has to be functional but I also am excited that it looks pretty now here is everything all decorated and at least half of our bathroom is finished I'm loving how it's looking so far and I can't wait to get like our new shower system installed I think it's just going to tie everything together and it's gonna look it's gonna look really good so for sure stick around for those videos or that video I'm not sure if it's gonna be like another one or two videos but it will for sure be filmed as always I hope that my channel gives you guys some inspiration to make over your space or just make it something that makes you feel good. I know that I have not always had this like touch for decorating and making everything look nice and neat, but other than like just it looks good like in pictures, it just makes us feel better about the spaces in our home and it really does just create an overall sense of well-being like as far as our mental health um, when we have a space that we just love being in it just makes being at home and staying at home that much better and it doesn't have to cost a fortune you can definitely find things that are affordable especially on Amazon and sales and clearance or you can just do things yourself so it's definitely achievable on a budget and I hope that my channel inspires you guys to kind of have that 
kind of feeling in your home as well if you're into it or if you just like watching videos and just kind of getting motivation to do all the mom things that have to be done or clean or just make over a space to make you feel better about your home either way i just genuinely appreciate you guys watching my videos and sticking around and commenting on the videos i love the engagement so much all right guys thank you so much for watching this video and i hope you stick around and subscribe so you can see what we are doing on the other side with the new shower and finishing just finishing up on the other side of the bathroom as well as other places in my home so thank you so much for watching this video and I <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one. Bye y'all. Sort of editing me here. So I realized when I did this whole video, I didn't even put any soap out. <laughs> How do you wash your hands? Um, Anyway, I bought these soaps. I found these at Walmart, actually, and they're the Birchwood scent. They smell so good. So I just got two of those. Also, so disappointed. This was my favorite face wash. If you watched, if you have watched my channel like before, you know that I've mentioned this a few times. It was my favorite face wash. It got my makeup off like super, super easy. It says new and improved. They lied. Total lies. It is not new and improved. It is worse and worse. So I tried this. Um, and it worked decently. But now I have to find a new face wash. So if you guys, if you guys have a favorite face wash and you wear like, I mean, you wear like a lot of makeup like I do. Let me know if you find if you have something that takes that takes it all off that's not like super expensive. This is like how much is this? Like 11, 12 dollars for this big thing. And it lasts along for 16 ounces. I don't want to pay a bunch of money, but I mean I will pay a little bit of money. You know what I mean? Anyway, I thought I would just show you. I do have soap in my bathroom. <laughs> That's all. <laughs>